terminal when we get there um, but our number one job is to make sure we have active pickets going on around the terminal that means walking like actually actively walking and picketing um, so follow your picket captains there are Dan and David um, <clears throat> we have Amy and Craig on bullhorn or in this case mic checking until we get a bullhorn <laughs> Um, the other thing that we need to know is that when ILWU workers come into the port, we do not get in confrontation with them. Um, we we want to like basically if ILWU workers come in, come talk to uh, either David or Dan or myself. I'll be on communications all day. Um, we just want to make sure we have a good rapport with all ILWU workers that may be coming into the port. Um, so, number one, we do not get into confrontation with any of the workers. Um, okay. Do the, not stop the picket under any conditions. Not, Keep the picket yeah. going. Picket okay. line means we walk in a circle with as little space as possible between everyone, but trying to cover as much space as possible blocking the, the entrance. Is that the rest of them behind us? Yeah. Okay. All right. Is there anything else in that thing? Well, that also, uh, I was just telling folks how a picket line works for folks that might have not have done it before. A group of us went to a coordination meeting amongst the folks who did the organizing uh, with some rank and file union folks, and the request is not to block anyone from leaving, which is both trucks and individual workers, uh, and we want to keep workers out, not keep the, them or their trucks in. So that's the request and. We're also doing community pickets. We're not doing a blockade of Maritime or any of the major roads. We had a little bit of an issue last time with people blocking workers trying to get home. Yeah. And the, uh, the, the, tactical, the tactical request for if the police do show up is keep picketing. If they try and grab one of us, just everyone else keep picketing. Keep the, the, the priority is to keep the pickets going, um, keep the pickets legal picketing. The reason we walk in a circle is that's the legally recognized picket. Um, the police may try to break that up, but if we keep picketing, it's it's going to be that much better rather than letting them break it up for us. And the idea is the uh, ILW, the longshore shift is at 7, so we are supposed to have our picket up and running by 6 a.m. so that they can't bring any workers in. And the ILW workers from Local 10 who have been instructed not to cross picket lines and they'll be set somewhere else waiting. They then can call an arbitrator, and if we're a lively, rowdy, high-energy picket, the arbitrator will hopefully rule that we're a health and safety hazard. So our job is to be a little bit of a health and safety hazard. Hey, we're good at that. They've kind of identified that. We, we actually haven't been a stroll to cross. That is, it's not a bona fide picket. You know, by the you the by the leadership of the union. So, I mean, it's it's pretty much of an individual thing. But I mean, most guys that I talked to in Leaf have said they're not gonna cross, and they are not gonna go in under police um, protection. But just to be clear, we haven't been instructed by the leadership not to cross. They have said this is not a bona fide picket line, and we got a right to go to work. Just give people a clear idea of what's going on. No, no, have any ILW. You do try and cross, 
peacefully engage them, let them know we're here for them to make sure we have their backs exactly. up in Longshore so they can't bust the union, Long can't view. drive down wages. And the, we need to get his number away. And the other piece is uh, the morning shift is 7 a.m., so we may have to keep the picket going until we hear that there's a ruling on the arbitration. Could be 10 or 11. Can we march from here? Is it? jump out and march. We just get out from march. Can we march from here? So you already, how many people did you drop already, and where? The last part is there's a, a second shift at five or six o'clock. They block the traffic so we can. Where? Let me talk to Clarence. You with Clarence? I mean, what they gonna what they gonna pretty much try to do is is clear the picket lines. That's what they gonna do. Okay. Yeah. So did you guys hear that? Anthony said that the police is just pretty much gonna try to clear clear the picket lines and then tell the longshoremen that it's safe to go to work, and if they don't go to work, everybody fired. So they they want to put the longshoremen against the. Now that's what's been going on this whole time. They want to put the longshoremen against the occupy or the community, whatever you want to call it. Um, also, does everyone have the NLG number? Yeah. 415 285 1011. Okay, <laughs> anybody need a sharpie? <laughs> yeah. Okay, Who needs a sharpie? Write it on your arm. Yeah, we're going to drop it down. They're saving any more of you up 15 No, we're going to no. drop it down. Well, we're standing together. We're all San Francisco. We're all one group. Okay. We have many buses, and whether or not you, I mean, look, dude, we just need people to blockade the terminal, okay? So this is just a small group. We're going to drop some of you guys somewhere and the other buses somewhere else, okay? No, we stay together. No, no this is not. The other buses somewhere else. Yeah. Yeah, no, some, of, some of the shuttles are gonna get are gonna have people dropped off somewhere else. Yeah, that's, yeah. Oh, no, no, that's we understand. Yeah, we just went all together. This is staying together. <laughs> One of the most historic actions in United States history: the fact that we're shutting down the ports from Anchorage to San Diego on the West Coast. That Houston, Phoenix, um, and Denver are doing solidarity actions, as well as Boston and Wall Street, um, and Honolulu, and Japan, and Japan. So today is gonna be freaking amazing. Galveston. Well, if we get there. Boston. Denver. Three of the Hawaii. <laughs> Walmart. Galveston said they were gonna. I don't know if they're gonna shut down for the Galveston. He said. He said there's a hundred people at 50, 55. But I don't know how many people. Are and, and the 30, the port that we're going to now is actually two gates. It's one that the lone shoremen go in. But then it's another gate that they can also bring people in. That's where the truckers go in. But we also want to block both gates anyway, so the truckers can't go in. Who owns that one? Excuse who's me? at 30? Who over. Gate 30, is over. Or who? No, this is going to be Trey Pack. Oh, yeah. I mean, because what's happening is Trey Pack and Hanjin are gate the only two over. terminals that got ships in. Oh, yeah. But all the terminals are working because they have yard gangs where the truckers going to bring cargo in and take cargo out. But I guess it just depends on how many people we're going to get before we try to hit every tournament. I mean, if you have 10 so people at the gate, the ship first. that could be putting people in danger. Do we? Do you think we have enough people here to maintain a solid picket on both of those gates? There's already people over there. Okay. Cool. Maybe if this y'all group, maybe y'all can just handle one gate. Maybe the gate where the truckers come. Mm -hmm. Sure. Sorry, you can make a right. Right, right here? Yeah, the thing is, we got to make sure that not everyone is going to get off at 30 on all these buses. We are getting Just off together. Just two buses all together. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. okay. we'll be make a right. Maroon. This bus, I don't want everyone right. on all these back buses getting right. off the wrong place because we got to get a back up. All these back buses are getting off, so Anthony, just let us off real quick, and then we'll be off. Yeah. 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 Numbers here. All right, you're in the box. We participate in a show of strength um, in the never-ending battle between. Um, <laughs> Labor and man. Yeah. What's your name? Yeah. Kent Keys. Kent, Kent Keys. Where are you from, Kent Keys? I'm from San Francisco. San Francisco. I'm with us. Uh, yeah. Occupy San Francisco. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. To the next uh, port dock entry where the longshore enters. So we can move over a little bit. Go. Cool. Another sign, picket signs. Yeah. close as you can to the next person. Well, we got Keep walking. 
Keep walking, don't oh, break the wall. Keep walking. 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 Yeah. I can't afford it. Anymore. They might pull the sign, guys. And that's across the thing to get us a trespassing.